What would you say to Americans who are worried about a civil war erupting um, this month in January 2021? Um, that it's a real possibility with good reason there. They might be frightened of that or concerned about it um, because that's the intention. Um, that's the plot here um, of this uh, drama. The people in control are trying to effectuate a civil war in the United States. And that's, in a, on one hand, no secret. On the other, the particulars of that, those, that plot and its machinations are probably unknown to a lot of people. So it's a real threat, and they're, they're on the right flawed, I think, with that, and right to be frightened. Um, however, um, I think we have the power to overwrite their story. We have the power to write right over their fantasies of creating, fomenting, fabricating a civil war in the United States. We, as revolutionaries, have the power to write over that, and to ride over it, one could say. Um, I think it's really important not to let their fantasy of civil war or their larger plot um, unfold. Um, and for the sake of brevity, I don't want to go at this moment into what the larger plot is, but it's a big one. Um, and the civil war idea is part of it. So um, we have the power, is the important thing, not to let history be written in this way, not to let a civil war happen. What we need is a revolution which will make the Civil War irrelevant with all of its false positions, the false positions of Democratic Party supporters, the false positions of Republican Party supporters. Remember that the rulers, the real rulers, they create false positions, parties that serve their interests, um, and then they play those false sides against one another. That's nothing new in history, but it's important and prominent right now again. So remember, to me the important thing is, I'll say, don't accept the Civil War narrative, um, but not accepting it means you have to work to make it not real. What's real is what people make real. Um, I say let's make a revolution that rides right over the Civil War nonsense and these false divisions, what we need is a revolution that really serves justice, freedom, uh, peace, and well-being, and other things people value, and not the false cynical agenda of the neoconservatives who want a civil war.